Well, Mark, the Chanticleers dancing for the second consecutive year. This time heading to the Midwest, Omaha, Nebraska, where they face Wisconsin. It's a very good team this Chanticleer team will face on Friday, as Coach Cliff Ellis alluded to, along with the players after Selection Sunday. When the announcement was made, relief set in. It looked like it was either going to be Wisconsin or Arizona, so take your pick. <laughs> then the focus shifted to Wisconsin. A Badger team highly ranked and very successful. Another tough task for the Shawna Clares. They really didn't even acknowledge us at all as far as um, us having a chance against Wisconsin. So uh, we definitely feel a little bit extra motivation and a little bit uh, more fire inside. Yeah, they're not a team that's going to give you anything. So we got we to make sure we go in their discipline. And uh, if we do that, we'll be fine. Unlike last season, the Shots will enter this tournament unwavered after taking top seed to Virginia to the wire a year ago. I'll tell you what, the inexperienced team a year ago handled it pretty well. So these guys, that makes me feel good about the guys uh, that, that haven't been a part of the tournament. Of course, News Channel 15 Sports will be on hand with the Shawna Clares as they march their way to Omaha. We'll have all your details coming up as the week progresses and into Friday's first round game against the Badgers. Reporting from the HTC Center here on the campus of Coastal Carolina, Brandon Dunn, News Channel 15 Sports.